This tutorial is on standard payroll deductions, and in the example above, uh, Kyle works 40 hours per week and earns $11 an hour. However, his paycheck is only $385.15 per week. Why is the amount less than 440? And where the 440 comes from is if we take uh, 40 hours and multiply it by he's getting $11 for each of those, that would be his gross pay. But something's been deducted from that because his paycheck is only $385.15. Now the standard payroll deductions, and um, I'm teaching this from the from the perspective uh, on, of, in Ontario, Canada. So if you're in a different province, it's not going to differ very much. But if you're in a different country, it could differ quite a bit. The standard uh, deductions that I'm going to refer to are income tax, and then uh, Canada Pension Plan contributions, and employment insurance. There are some other ones listed here, like uh, you might pay union dues, for example, um, and uh, that's another topic. Those are, that's an example of another deduction because not everyone pays union dues. But everyone uh, with a certain level of income will pay income tax can, into the Canada Pension Plan and employment insurance. So those are the things that were uh, deducted from the 440 to get his paycheck amount of $385.15. So an example on the second page, uh, Jane works 35 hours per week and makes $14.57 per hour. She has the following deductions from her bi-weekly pay. So 5048 in CPP, 2652 in EI, and income tax deducted is $127.15. So you're asked, what is Jane's take-home pay? Well, we first need to calculate her bi-weekly, and this would be called her gross income, her income before anything is, is uh, deducted. So we would take her hourly rate and multiply it by 35, and uh, bi-weekly is every two weeks, so also we want to multiply that by two. So this is actually 70 hours on this pay, not 35, because it's every two weeks. And so that gives us uh, $1,019.90. So that's her bi-weekly pay. That's her gross bi-weekly pay. Now we want to calculate now her deductions. So our deductions, we would add the three of these together, the CPP, the EI, and the income tax. So we add those three uh, amounts together, and her standard deductions then are $204.15. So to get her take-home pay, or some people call it the net pay, we would take her gross income, the 1,019.90, $1 and subtract the $204.15 from that. So her take-home pay, the number that's going to be on her check, is $815.75. So that is her take-home or net pay. And that's the end of the tutorial.